They're here to help keep an eye on customers. They'll be hitting a number of other party stores throughout the city. This is a sort of in response in light of the murder of Tracy Golden at another party store. I'm loving this. Oh, yeah. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. How you doing? Our goal is to make sure that businesses uh, hold themselves accountable and have people out here that's looking uh, out for the women and children and elders and the vulnerable in our community. Anybody out here that's harming our people anybody out here that's being mischievous to our people bro we on your f***ing head like these corners so we got some guys back there just coming around the corner um you can see how how easy it is for somebody to sit and tucked off waiting on somebody what y'all okay. what up though what up though how y'all doing y'all all right so y'all got somebody out there y'all gonna keep it like that okay okay i ain't got nobody out there man watching on women go to the car bro y'all huh? gonna work on Okay. We want to make sure that we start to set the standard when we're talking about safety in our communities and particularly when, when we talk about women coming to these liquor stores and gas stations at night. So we need to be the example. It starts with us. Detroit police releasing this surveillance video showing the victim leaving the store. The suspect approaching her in the parking lot and then opening fire. He then went through her pockets, stealing her keys and driving off in her SUV. Surrounded by the investigators that tracked and caught his wife's accused killer, John Golden says some relief in the arrest of 19-year-old Bradley Thurman. I will never have closure because my angel is not here. Thurman, now charged with murder, being held on an unprecedented bond, $4 million cash. When you see someone like her, she represents all of us. Innocence just stopping at a store in our, in our neighborhoods. Detectives said Tuesday Thurman's motive robbery, picking Tracy at random December 28th at the store off Grand River near Outer Drive, just minutes from her house. Police found her SUV dumped a day later across town off Seven Mile near I-75 at this family dollar store. Daily Caller Patriots have access to thousands of exclusive articles and interviews, including with such great people as Tucker Carlson, Megyn Kelly, Candace Owens, Donald Trump Jr. It's time to ditch the corporate narratives and the media spin. You deserve so much better. Become a Daily Caller Patriot today.